Lisa, also known as La Dolce Lisa, here with another video today. This video is very exciting because Valentine's Day is right around the corner and you might have a special date or even a Galentine's date planned. And if you do, I have you covered because I'm going to be showing you several dressy outfits that you can wear for a perfect night out so that you'll look and feel your best for Valentine's Day. And of course, this can also just be a regular date night guide as well, but I figured with Valentine's Day right around the corner, this is the perfect video. So without talking too much, I just want to show you my first look and we'll get right into it with my Valentine's Day date night outfit. my first outfit I decided I would go with an all red outfit because it is perfect for Valentine's Day and I feel like red on red on red is very in this year. Of course you can also use red shoes but I just decided to pair it with some nude pumps because I thought it would break up the look just a tiny bit while still keeping the very red theme. I also have this red purse. Now what I really like about this dress is the fact that it is long sleeve. The long sleeve is perfect for this Canadian weather that is quite cold now. Valentine's Day is usually freezing so I like to be as warm as possible. This dress is super cute and it has this nice scallop detailing which I really like as well. I had to pair it with a little bandeau underneath because it is quite revealing and I didn't want to show that much off. <laughs> but I really like this red color. It is very vibrant and pretty and it is of course this baby doll style dress so that if you're going out to eat for Valentine's Day you don't have to feel like you have to suck in your stomach the whole time. I really like this dress because I love the sleeves, I love the color and I love all the pretty details about this. So I think this is the perfect outfit for a Valentine's date night. So I don't know about you guys, but when I think about Valentine's Day, I think red, I think lace, and I also think floral prints because floral prints are very romantic. And I love the idea of having a floral print jumpsuit. So you also have this wide-legged jumpsuit going on so you'll feel really comfortable and you won't be too cold in just a little dress out there because the weather, like I said, is freezing. So I really love the idea of this jumpsuit with sleeves. It has this little pretty bell sleeve idea going on here. It has these beautiful floral prints. And I decided since it is already so busy with the prints, I just kept it simple with just a simple black bag and simple black shoes that also have a really cute detailing. And I also like the fact that this jumpsuit has the long sleeves and it also has the long pant legs, but they don't reach the floor entirely, so you can show off a little bit of ankle there, which is why I chose these specific shoes for this jumpsuit. I really love it. I love the romantic feel, and I love how comfortable jumpsuits can be. So they are one of my absolute favorite wardrobe essentials because they're so easy. You don't have to worry about pairing your pants with a beautiful top. You can just throw on a jumpsuit and you're good to go. I feel like I would describe this next outfit as sort of classy and businessy meets sexy and elegant with this very pretty lace top. Of course, the lace top is not too revealing because it does go all the way up to your neck. However, it is a bit see-through, so I thought to be a little bit playful, I paired it with a red bra underneath. You could, of course, pair this with like a black bra or a bandeau if you want it to be less in your face, I guess you can say. But because it's Valentine's Day, I just wanted to throw a pop of red in there and I think it goes really well with the lips and, of course, my nails. And I decided to keep everything simple, so it is basically essentially an all-black outfit with just a couple pops of red and I thought that was very pretty for Valentine's Day. So again, the lace is a little bit sexy, but it is also feminine and not too revealing and I decided to pair this with a nice long pencil skirt. And I really like this fringy flare detail here. It is of course covering your stomach, so it is also very flattering. Without being too much in your face, you're still looking very sexy yet elegant. So I think that a pencil skirt is a great idea for a Valentine's Day dinner. I paired it with these black heels that are a little bit playful. There's some peekaboo detailing on the sides and of course there's a little tie bowstring which I loved as well. And just a very simple pochette little purse because I love the idea of just having a tiny little purse and keeping the bare minimum especially for a date night. So I really love the way this outfit came out and it just goes to show you that an all black outfit can still be very sexy while also staying classy and timeless. So it is perfect for Valentine's Day. With this next outfit, in keeping the floral theme alive, I decided to show you a look with white pants and soft pink florals. These, of course, are high-waisted pants 
that are also wide legged so they're super comfortable and they are perfect to wear with a crop top because you can still feel very comfortable and confident in this. Would have already seen this crop top in my Forever 21 haul video. You probably know that this is a great deal. I love the crush velvet look of it. It was very feminine and flirty and this whole outfit to me just screams Valentine's Day especially if you are a girly girl and you love more of the neutral and soft pink colors. This is perfect for you. I just paired it with this very simple pale pink purse and I really love small bags especially for a date night. And of course just the simple nude pump. You might not just be doing dinners for Valentine's Day. This could also be perfect for even a brunch. So I thought that this was very pretty and I love the color palette of this whole outfit as well. This next outfit is a great way on how you can wear one of your summer dresses or just shorter sleeve dresses because this dress is short sleeve and it's a bit too cold outside for that. So I decided to pair it with this cape blazer because I thought it was a great way on sprucing up your outfit while also secretly keeping you warm in this kind of weather. And I decided to not pair it with an over the shoulder purse, but just a little clutch because you don't really want anything over these kind of shoulders. I thought it was a nice way of playing up a simple black lacy dress and throwing in a pop of color and also adding these interesting touches like knee-high boots and this sort of cape blazer going on to give your outfit that really special look for Valentine's Day. So I thought that this was a great outfit. I'm just in love with this almost like violet pink color. This color is like nothing I've ever had before so I thought that this was a really pretty touch in just making your outfit that much more exciting and playful. Of course you can also wear this with simple pumps or just any kind of booty as well but I I thought over the knee boots are just a great touch and I really love them for this time of year. I just really like how this outfit came together. It screams a Valentine's Day without being too in your face, so I really like that as well. For my final outfit, there's a lot going on here, so I want to explain a little bit about this outfit. I basically have a sort of ballerina vibe going on here with this translucent sheer top. It's so pretty because it has this really nice polka dot gold vibe, and of course because this shirt is very revealing, I paired it with a high-waisted flared out skirt. I thought that this was a really cute look together, and I also decided to go with some nude fishnet stockings, and they also have a little bit of gold going on in them to tie in with the shirt, and of course I paired these with some nice nude booties. You would have also seen these booties in my Forever 21 haul. I absolutely love these booties, guys. I thought they looked really cute with this skirt. This shirt was almost a little bit too revealing for me, but I also paired it with a bralette underneath as well. If you had a bandeau, that would probably be even better, but I can't find mine right now, otherwise that would be great. But I really like the detailing. I like that it's long sleeve, but sheer, so it's also super pretty and feminine and flirty and sexy. There's a lot going on with the fishnet and the booties and the transparency of it all, but I thought that this was a really cute outfit and I love the way it came together. So there you have it. Those were my several Valentine's Day date night looks. And of course, these don't just have to be for Valentine's Day, but they can be for any date night or girls night as well. I hope these looks really inspired you on what you can wear for that special night out. And of course, if you do like these type of fashion videos, give me a thumbs up so I know I'm on the right track. And of course, I hope you also will be subscribing to my channel because I'll have new videos every single week. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys, and happy Valentine's Day.